Based on size alone, many sauropods had natural defenses from just how staggeringly large some of them grew. Their enormous limbs and their giant tails were tremendous weapons if swung correctly and could potentially deliver fatal blows. An encounter with a huge sauropod would have been an extremely dangerous encounter and could have proven fatal for even the largest of predatory dinosaurs. But did sauropods have natural predators? The easy answer to that question is juveniles as well as sick sauropods most likely did. In the modern day world, if we assume a weight of around 10,000 pounds for an elephant and 500 pounds for a lion, means that one elephant weighs roughly 20 times what a lion does. A pretty staggering difference. This is why hunting in packs is necessary. Predatory dinosaurs more than likely employed the same tactic as well. Let's use the example of a 10,000 pound theropod attacking a 50 ton sauropod. That would be 10 times the size of the predator. A mass of 10 times the size of the predator would make a solitary attack on a huge herbivore highly unlikely. Hunting in coordinated efforts together would have made taking down such enormous prey seem believable. Now let's add some juvenile theropods into the mix, adding some more meat and bulk. And if we assume a few of these juveniles weighed 1.5 tons each, and they were fast and fleet-footed, and let's assume that there was four of these young predators in the pack, they each weighed 1.5 tons. And let's also add one more adult predatory dinosaur into the pack that weighed four tons, bringing the total number of predators in this pack to two adults and four juveniles. Together, the pack of six would have weighed a grand total of 15 tons, or 30,000 pounds in weight. Now, a pack of six predators with a combined total weight of 30,000 pounds squaring off against a sauropod weighing 100,000 pounds certainly sounds more believable. But as Dr. Malcolm from Jurassic Park told us, oftentimes life works in a chaotic manner that is not possible to predict. What if another adult sauropod joins in the fight against the pack of six, bringing the total weight to 200,000 pounds of sauropod against 30,000 pounds of theropods? You get the point. Life is unpredictable. A giant healthy sauropod more than likely had no predators. But young sauropods, and ones overcome with sickness and illness, most definitely would have been fair game.